know, we lost by one against a team that's very good, and I think that we, we underestimated them a little bit and came out um, with a certain game plan, and we did have to make adjustments, and those mid-game adjustments um, took a while for us to get a, a handle on, and unfortunately that really made us uh, pay for it in the end. We did actually pretty well with the ground ball stat. We did pretty well um, also with the turnover stat um, in comparison to Niagara, but we still couldn't put the ball away. So um, we did a lot, of, a lot of great things in the midfield, although um, I know there were times that it was messy, but we couldn't get the last part done. We couldn't put the ball away. We couldn't uh, make that, that goal happen for us. And that's something that we need to we need to kind of coach that a little bit more and knowing how to finish. We do have a tremendous amount of fight, that's for sure. And I think that, um, unfortunately, um, midway through the game, I think the girls recognized um, what they're going to really have to put into the game in order to have the win. And it was a little bit uh, too late for us. So we have to make sure that we have that fight from the get-go. Um, and you know, having them score the first three goals is something that we want to try to avoid so we can be on the other end of that. And then it'll help us you know, um, throughout the game, um, throughout the, that second half as well. We have to learn from this, of course. Um, we have to know that every MAC opponent is a MAC opponent, and um, every conference game is just as important as the next. Um, and any one that we see, we know that they're going to be hungry for the win. So um, this should be a learning experience for us, and hopefully something that we don't look back on um, as anything other than that.